Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Melissa. Today we are making easy tacos, but with a twist on it. Let's go. Okay, so the next step is obviously we have to cook the meat. You can get whatever ground beef you use, or even turkey if you want to, but I'm gonna use ground beef. I'm gonna put this in the pan. So up to you, you can add any seasonings to your ground beef or keep it the way it is. I like to add a little bit of seasoning into the meat to give it flavor. So I'm going to use some garlic salt and smoked paprika. I just love garlic and I think garlic goes on everything. Now, as your ground beef is cooking, you can do your setup or taco. As you can see, we are using Dorito bags instead of plates or regular taco stuff. Here I have diced yellow onions and also diced tomatoes for easy cleanup. And make sure to save the containers because you can always reuse them. Also got a sour cream, easy to use, no cleanup, some lettuce and some taco blend. All right, now that your taco or hamburger meat is done, you're gonna make sure you drain all the grease and stuff. Drain this. I put two napkins down here because I don't have a cloth and it works just as fine to make sure the grease goes out and you don't lose a bunch of hamburger meat. All right, so now that your hamburger meat is drained, you're gonna add according to the water on your taco package, unless you make your own, using two seasons of taco mix. And then just gonna give it a nice mix so that everything mixes together. Now, dinner's ready. All right guys, now that your hamburger is done and all ready to go, we're gonna go ahead and prepare the tacos. I'm gonna use a Dorito bag. You can use any kind of chips that you like, but I enjoy the Doritos. Crunch them up if you want. Then you're gonna add the beef. And then if you want, you can add onions, which I don't eat onions, so we're gonna skip that one. But if you like onions, you can add them. Gonna add some tomato. Can't forget the cheese, because everybody loves cheese, at least I do. So we're gonna add some cheese into your bag, and then a bag of lettuce already shredded, so you don't have to cut it. Add a handful, or even more if you want, just like that. Then you're gonna take your sour cream that's in a bag and just squeeze it in there like that. And then your spoon, and you just mix it around like this, and you are ready to eat. So as you can see, this is an easy meal. It doesn't take a lot of preparation. All you have left are some dirty spoons and pan that you use to make the hamburger meat in. And it's done. And I think everyone loves this meal, anywhere from kids to adults, because it's easy, it's fun, and it's not that hard. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for next week for another easy episode of Easy Recipes. Make sure you're subscribed, have that bell on, and don't forget to give this video a like because it helps out. Also comment down below if you try it, let me know what you think. And if you have any other ideas, let me know in the comments as well. And I will try them and give you a shout out. Until next time guys, see ya.